Hey everybody, welcome to week number three in our Thank You Thursday series. I hope that last week your prayers of gratitude went very well and that you've felt a change in your heart and in your mindset and that you felt yourself become closer to God through that practice. So this week, the invitation that I am going to issue and that I hope will become a practice in your life always is to take a look behind the scenes. Now what I mean by that is that there are a lot of people that provide service for us and yes, it is their job sometimes to provide that, but it is a service nonetheless. But they provide that behind the scenes in a, somewhere that we don't see. For instance, we had to have our car serviced and so I took it into the shop and I don't know how to do those things on our vehicle and I depend upon those people who do. So we dropped it off and I had decided that I wanted to thank the people who actually performed the labor on our vehicle. And so I took a thank you note with me last week and wrote it out as I sat in the waiting room and was able to give it to the attendant as I left. I didn't see that service happen, but I know that it did because my car runs better. Um, there is a lot of service that happens somewhere that we don't see. And because we don't see it, we often take it for granted. So this week, my invitation to you is to take a look at your life and find those that serve you and your family behind the scenes that maybe don't even get a verbal thanks for what they do. And go, go a step further, write a thank you note. Stick one in your pocket or your purse or the, your backpack, whatever you have with you so that you have it and you can write it to someone when you see that happening or when you realize it. Um, so it could be maybe you go out to eat and of course we thank our server typically, but do we think to thank the cook? And that happens at home as well. Do we think to thank the cook? Uh, what about if we, it's Thanksgiving time and so many of you will travel. Do you think to maybe thank the housekeeper that kept that hotel room rather nice for you, that cleaned while you were there or that made sure it was nice before you arrived? Or what about, uh, my kids thought of this one this week and that's their goal for this week is to thank their custodian at their school. They've had some sickness, and so the custodian is the one who gets stuck at school doing some of the stinky jobs, is what we say. And so our kids decided that they wanted to thank the custodian. So that's what they'll be working on. So help us out. You guys are so smart and so full of ideas. I've just given you a couple here. What I would love for you to do this week is post in the comments below your idea and who you see that serves behind the scenes and how you are going to thank them. Um, it can be just a quick little post after you've watched this video, hey, here's my idea. And that will help the rest of us out, help to broaden our perspective and help us to see those people that maybe don't, don't get seen and to thank them for what they do. Because of the men and women who service my vehicle, my family can be on the road. We can get to piano lessons and get to school and work and all of those things that we do so that we can develop our skills and our talents. So because of their skills and talents, we can develop ours. So post your ideas in the comments below. And then I would ask that if this is inspiring to you, this Thank You Thursday idea, if you would share it on social media, share it with your friends or your family or whoever you think might benefit. Um, I'd love for this to be a great movement that can increase our gratitude as a nation, as a world for each other. So have a great Thursday and I will see you next week on Thanksgiving. See ya!